In this harrowing story from April 10, 1968, we follow the terrifying experience of Stephen Sample and his father, Milton, at Sanguera Island Beach in Florida. It was a seemingly ordinary Saturday, with families enjoying the warm and calm waters. Little did they know that a group of teenagers, seeking a day of shark fishing, would set off a chain of events that would turn this day into a nightmare. If you are new kindly, like, share, and subscribe for more interesting video, thank you. On that day, the beach was filled with families, children building sandcastles, and swimmers enjoying the pleasant weather. Unbeknownst to the nearby swimmers, a group of teenagers engaged in a reckless activity. They baited long lines with fresh fish, attracting sharks to the area, and then went into the water, pouring a bucket of animal blood to initiate a feeding frenzy. Stephen and his father, Milton, entered the sea, with Stephen eager to test his fishing gear. Milton on an inflatable float. While Stephen explored underwater, Milton floated nearby, enjoying the sea. However, little did they know that their day would take a horrifying turn. After about half an hour, Milton decided to get out of the water. Meanwhile, Stephen, snorkeling with fins, was exploring the underwater world. Suddenly, he noticed a large fin approaching him. In a panic, he swam towards the shore, feeling a powerful tug on his leg. A shark had bitten him. Stephen screamed for help, and Milton, hearing his son's cries, rushed back into the water. As Milton approached, he saw not just one but multiple sharks in a feeding frenzy. The attack lasted only a few minutes, but it felt like a lifetime for everyone involved. Witnesses on the beach watched in shock as the scene unfolded. Thomas Fletcher, a vacationer observing the events, paddled towards Stephen on a surfboard. Despite initially mistaking Stephen for sitting on an inflatable boat, Thomas realized the dire situation. Milton dove towards his son, and as Stephen struggled to stay above water, Thomas reached them, applying pressure to Stephen's wounds. With quick thinking and coordination, they moved Stephen onto an inflatable bed and carried him towards the approaching ambulance. The prompt actions of witnesses and beachgoers played a crucial role in saving Stephen's life. Despite suffering multiple bites, including his leg, arm, buttocks, and back, Stephen survived the ordeal. The aftermath involved an investigation into the reckless behavior of the teenage fishermen who attracted sharks near the tourist beach. Property owners and local communities were also accused of negligence for not providing adequate warnings or protections. Stephen Sample, despite enduring a traumatic shark attack, lived to tell the tale thanks to the swift and courageous actions of those who witnessed the event. The incident serves as a stark reminder of the potential dangers lurking in the waters, as well as the importance of responsible behavior to ensure the safety of beachgoers. If you found this story intriguing or have any thoughts to share, please like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more gripping narratives. Thank you for joining us on this journey into a moment of survival amidst a terrifying shark attack.